Good evening, I'm Cynthia Arsenault. Although cockfighting has been banned in Louisiana for 16 years, animal advocates say the remnants of the practice are still common in the state, but arrests are few. KPLC's Morgan Babineau talks to advocates about what needs to be done to strengthen the law and increase investigations. We're way behind the rest of the nation on animal fighting investigations. <laughs> Cockfighting has been around for centuries. It's illegal in all 50 states and a felony in 39 states. The last state to ban cockfighting was actually Louisiana in 2008. Cockfighting has been part of our, you know, culture in Louisiana, especially the Cajun area, for a long, long time. There's a lot of pride associated with it. Not many arrests have been made for cockfighting since the ban, but animal rights activists say these operations are still very prevalent in Louisiana. And law enforcement in Louisiana, we find, although we're supportive of them, supportive and don't mean to be extra critical, they really don't uh, assign this duty to any specific detective or there's no task force. There's no correlation or cooperation with humane societies. Animal advocates say cockfighting charges are rarely filed alone, like Derek F. Thibodeau, who was arrested this week in Sulphur for sex trafficking. It wasn't until officials executed a search warrant that they discovered the roosters and fighting paraphernalia. We're going to contact the sheriffs, uh, all 64 of them, very soon, for the next few weeks, on animal fighting enterprises so that they're ready, so that they have a networking capability and partners in place for both roosters and fighting dogs. Animal rights activists say the practice of raising fighting gamecocks to sell is growing. Dorson says the gray area in cockfighting laws isn't the only area that needs improvements. So let's say you make an arrest on roosters or dog fighters and you have 50 dogs or chickens. There's no place to house them. Fighting roosters are kept with really short tethers on their ankles with little pyramid-shaped wooden structures for shelter, Dorson says. If you do spot any of these signs, you are urged to contact your local law enforcement. Morgan Babineau, 7 News. In 2023, Senator John Kennedy introduced a bill that would expand protections by banning broadcasting and gambling on animal fights and stopping the transport of certain roosters through mail. The Fight Act was read and referred to the committee in May of 2023, but hasn't recorded any action since.